We all know one of the most annoying things about this job is when you get to a restaurant and either the restaurant is closed or the staff at the restaurant or the shop say this order's already been collected, uh, possibly stolen. Um, and then you're left having done the trip all the way to the restaurant, um, having to cancel the order and getting nothing back from it. Well, there always used to be a way of getting some money back from it. It didn't seem to be working for a bit, and it's something that the GMB brought up in the latest meeting. It's something that Deliveroo has said has been fixed, and I just wanted to try it a few times before I reshared it with you. Um, this is how you get a little bit, not very much, a little bit of money back from Deliveroo for a wasted journey. So, if you arrive at the restaurant or the supermarket or the shop or wherever it is, and the order is not there ready for you to collect, you simply... Uh, go to to cancel the order like you normally would reject the order uh, but click restaurant is closed um, or if the order's already been collected I think there's a already been collected button I'd always click on that one just in case but I don't think it matters too much then you what you want to do is go to um, Google or your search engine put in delivery fee query form now, when you first open it up, it's going to ask for your name, your rider ID, what area you're in, etc. So fill out all those bits. And then what I've done is I've got a notepad ready, like thing ready, where I just put in the order number. So what you want to do is basically just write, um, I arrived today to pick up at X supermarket, or X shop, whatever, restaurant, Um to collect order number 4684 or whatever order number it is. Um, give your reasons to why you couldn't pick it up. And say, please um, reimburse me the £2 fee as agreed with Deliveroo HQ. And hopefully they should reimburse you. So this didn't work for a while. We brought it up, as said at the meeting. Um... They've told us that it's been fixed, and I before I've made this video, what I wanted to do is just try it out a few times. So I've gone to a few restaurants over the last two weeks or so since the meeting, um, where I've not been able to pick up for one of these reasons. So it's only if like the restaurant is closed or the order is taken. You can't do this for if there's like a long wait or whatever, which is a bit annoying, but that's just the way it is. So it's only if the order actually physically definitely cannot be collected. Um, so yeah, I've tried it now, I think, three or four times every time they paid me out. Um, so yeah, definitely give this a go, guys. What I'd advise you is, because I know I stopped doing it because obviously they stopped paying. But even before that, I stopped doing it just because it's a bit of a cumbersome long-winded process what we want to ask them for really is like an instant button that you can press uh, but we're a little way away from that uh, but what i'd advise is what i've done is to go onto like your notepad on your phone write out like a script and just keep like the order number and like the location like empty so then every time you can just quickly go on to the fee query form quickly put your name it does remember your name and your email um, the only thing you have to put in every time is your rider ID and which area you're in. Um, so then you can just copy and paste that script. Just put the order number in and the where you went to collect it. And hopefully you guys will start getting paid out for these wasted journeys. Because <clears throat> it's frustrating, uh, to put it frankly. But let me know how you get on, guys. Please, please, if it's not working for you, please let me know. We can feed that back to the company and hopefully get it fixed again. Um, but from what I can see, it seems to be working. So as I say, um, please give it a go. Hopefully it's fixed. Hopefully you get a little bit of money back. It only takes, if you do what I say and have a script ready, it only takes a matter of like maybe two minutes to complete so two quid for two minutes is worth it um generally as well if it's busy i find that i'll pick up another order while i'm wait while i'm doing it anyway so it always ends up worthwhile but yeah hopefully that's fixed hopefully that's a small win for us get a little bit of money out of the company um 
let me know in the comments how you get on with it. If you've got any questions about anything to do with the GMB, anything to do with delivery or any other questions, please pop them in the comments as well. Uh, but I'll see you in the next video. If not, cheers. Bye.